We've finally done it! The world's first humanoid robot! Ian, can you say hi? Hi. Brilliant! All right, Ian, we're gonna run some tests on you to see if you can pass as a human. Are you ready? I was born ready. Uh, I mean, maybe. <laughs> All right, kid. Test number one is to survive a day at high school. Think you can do that? High school, the quintessential place where all human beings learn suffering. He's perfect! Hello, class. This is our new student, Ian. He's from... Where are you from again? The lab. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. Right, so why don't you go take a seat next to Sarah over there? Hey, Ian. My name's Sarah. Hi, my name is Ian. Oh, are you okay? Sarah, would you like to go to prom with me? Oh, uh... No talking during class, teacher. Ian. I am speaking right now. <laughs> yeah, I would love to. Great. Oh? Dude, you're a beast. Beast. An animal. Especially large or dangerous. I am yeah, a Yeah, yeah, whatever. Anyways, word on the street is that Chad was gonna ask her. And now that she's going with you, he wants to fight you. Chad, what an unpleasant name. What you say, pretty boy? In a totally platonic way? Chad, man! Speaking in third person, do humans usually do that, or is he just malfunctioning? Oh, so he's funny. I was supposed to go to prom with Sarah. It appears you are the comedian because she is going to prom with me. Ha, ha. Oh, you're asking for it, buddy? Sensing danger. Engaging eye lasers now. Yo, what the- Ha ha, ha ha, just kidding. That should be enough. Yo, what are you? A humanoid He's robot. A human! A human! Obviously a human! Hi Chad! Bye Chad! Sarah, you must Okay, admire. Ian, we need to go! I'm getting to the bottom of this. Bottom of what? Your status use for a life? You! Time to go! How did you know I'm a robot? Because no one stands up to Chad like that, let alone a teacher? Well, wouldn't life be much easier if we just made certain people stop talking? Yeah, but it's not that simple. Hey Sarah. Huh? Let me show you something. Hold my hand. Okay. Hold tight. Wait, you can fly? <laughs> wow, what a strong grip you have. <laughs> beautiful, isn't it? Oh, yeah. I never knew Murktown City could look this beautiful. Hey, what's the real reason you're at our school? As a humanoid robot, it is my primary job to become so vividly human that a human could not tell the difference. So, why did they send you to a high school? High school, the quintessential place where all human beings learn yeah. suffering. Because Sarah, what's more human than love? Oh. So you're looking for love? Well, it's a good thing there's a lot of girls in the school. Hey Sarah, guess what? Oh, not again. No! Why'd you let go of me? Uh-oh. Gotcha. Prepare for a smooth landing. You just dropped me from 60 feet up in the air! <laughs> because I wanted to save your life. You don't save someone's life by almost taking it! If you're looking for love, find it elsewhere, because we are not going to prom together anymore! Test failed. Self-destructing in three, two... Sir, wait! Gotcha. Prepare for a smooth landing. You just dropped me from 60 feet up in the air! <laughs> because I wanted to save your life. You don't save someone's life by almost taking it! If you're looking for love, find it elsewhere, because we are not going to prom together anymore! Test failed. Self-destructing in three, two... Sir, wait! I, I don't know how to explain it when I'm around you, I... What? You feel human? Yeah. Come with me. This is... A graveyard. Since your goal is to become human, I thought you should see this. Uh, Ian, you have a gift. You're neither human nor robot. You're something in between. And rotting away in the dirt? This doesn't have to be the end for you. So, why become human? Because... This is... A graveyard. Since your goal is to become human, I thought you should see this. Oh. Ian, you have a gift. You're neither human nor robot. You're something in between. And rotting away in the dirt? This doesn't have to be the end for you. So, why become human? Because, as a robot, all I can do is fulfill tasks, be of service, carry out the dirty work that no one else wants to do. But, as a human, I could have emotions, relationships, a life. And sure, it would end, but that's a risk I'm willing to take. Then let me ask you one more thing. Why would you ever trust a human? What? Nice work, Sarah. We got him right where we wanted. I don't understand. You loved me. I guess he's dumber than we thought, huh? Some beast you are. You have no idea. Why would you ever trust a human? What? Nice work, Sarah. We got him right where we wanted. I don't understand. You loved me. I guess he's dumber than we thought, huh? Some beast you are.
You have no idea. You think we can't handle some laser eyes? It's 2070. A simple telonium shield would block the laser and send it right back to you. I'm sorry to do this, Ian, but if it makes you feel any better, I actually did find this version of you kind of cute. This version of me? Ian, you're the 10,705th prototype of a humanoid robot they've sent to this test high school, and I've said the same thing to every single one before annihilating them. You'll never fool us. Humans are too intricate, so... I'm sorry, buddy, but this is goodbye. Wait, don't destroy this one. He has a- Goodbye, my robot ass. I forgot this prototype can fly. Ian, you're the 10,705th prototype of a humanoid robot they've sent to this test high school. And I've said the same thing to every single one before annihilating them. You'll never fool us. Humans are too intricate. So, I'm sorry, buddy, but this is goodbye. Wait, don't destroy this one. He has a- Goodbye, my robot ass. I forgot this prototype can fly. I'm a, I'm a prototype? But, but how? He said- He said we'd finally done it when he finished creating me. What do you mean by that? I thought I'd find you here. You are special. Ian 10705? 10705 meaning I'm a 10,705th prototype, right? Special no longer has meaning to me. When I said we'd finally done it, I said we because it was you and me. You, my son. I lost my Ian 10 years ago in a car accident. You were my top student, along with all your friends back there who lost you too. So, of course they hate when the prototypes don't work out. But that's the reason you're special. It's because you're the first one to sacrifice your own life. And I believe it's because you have a human what? So, what did you guys think about season one of The Robot? The crazy thing about this story is that it might just be the future soon. Anyways, let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this video and what your favorite part was. Mine was the ending for sure. And follow my Instagram at ianbogs with a Z because I post daily updates on there. And you will also get a chance to be part of these videos by voting on the polls I post on my Instagram story where I let you guys decide on which direction the story's going. And before you watch my next video, stick around to watch my original Robot Human series that I filmed three whole parts of over two years ago. That is crazy. If you've been following me for over two years now, send me a DM on Instagram because I love you. Anywho, hit that like, subscribe, and bell notification button to actually be the first to my videos. And to comment on them because I keep seeing comments that say first multiple times. <laughs> and share this video with a friend who you think or know will enjoy. All right, Ian Nation Battalion. That's our hand sign for now. Ah, this is an A. This is like an I kind of. That's an N. I love you, you're amazing, stay you, and I will see you in my next video. And top right here to watch my last series, if you haven't already. Peace!